Hey there, how are you doing? This is Kali from Tech Fans. Yes. So this is my uh, Redmi Note 10 Pro, and in this video we will see how to unlock the bootloader on the Redmi Note 10 Pro. So it works for Redmi Note 10 Pro Max. So the process is simple. It is same like uh, every other MI, uh, MIUI. So not only on this, but uh, this process also works on in other MIUI based device. So first I have uh, my uh, MI flash tool on my PC but before uh, getting into that we need to do a uh, few prerequisites uh, to unlock the bootloader. So here it may look like a pixel but it is uh, just a MIUI tool which I have installed. So I will just open the settings and then first thing that you need to do is uh, enabling the developer option. So first I will go there and I have the MIUI version I think. So I am already a developer so I will just go back now and I will go to um, additional settings and then here I have the MI uh, developer option I will enable that. So here I need to first enable the OEM unlocking so which asks for the pattern I will enable that after that I need um, I need to agree this one and I need to add the it also asking for the sim card so first i will uh, insert on sim card and then i will start trying this one a few minutes later so now i have installed a sim card so now i will try to add this one so turn off wi-fi and add your account using the mobile data so i don't even have the mobile data so uh, these are really really worst things about the mi a few minutes later so now i have recharged it and i will just turn off the wi-fi and turn on the mobile data so it is turned on now i will just add the account my account is added uh, successfully so now what i have to do is i have i have to download the mia tool which i have already downloaded it in my pc so OEM unlock this one and MIUI unlock status add account so my account is added now so if I open again it will ask again I believe so I also enable the um, USB debugging okay so these are the things that you have to do uh, in your mobile so now uh, let us go to our PC also I will uh, connect the uh, USB cable uh, uh, to my mobile so it is connected now uh, my PC is recording so in my PC I will just export uh, the MIUI tool inside the same folder I already have installed the driver so if you have any doubts on installing the driver please use the link uh, video which appears in the card right now so now I have uh, extracted this one and I will double click this exe tool also I have a driver 64 under this one here this one also you can use it but I uh, as I have as I already have those things I no need it uh, now uh, 5.436 it's not required i'll click on agree and same account i have to use here so there i have used my uh, uh, google account but here i am not sure how i can use my google account so i will just uh, um, india and then a few minutes later so I have signed in to my account in my in this one. So so now I need to get into the bootloader. Uh, for that I can uh, use uh, ADB command. But here I will be using uh, the method that the PC is telling. So first I need to turn off the mobile, which I will do now. Now I need to hold volume down and power button to enter into uh, this one. Volume down and power I'm holding. Okay, now I'm in fast boot. 
so my device is uh, detected now uh, unlock will erase user data so i believe uh, that is fine after you unlock the device it will be less secure your phone data may be locked list fingerprint recognition find device and other features will not even fingerprint won't work uh, will not no longer be reliable okay so it is not reliable so also yeah if you have a uh, set up things and if you want to unlock means make sure you have you back up all your data before uh, doing this so yeah warning that so i will just click unlock even though it won't unlock now it will ask for one week time i believe so that is there so currently it is unlocking the bootloader Ninety-nine, it will tell one hour, uh, one sixty-eight hours later, uh, which is uh, nearly a uh, one week after. So currently it is uh, twenty-two. Uh, so I have to be coming at twenty-nine next uh, Thursday. So this video will start at the next Thursday once this one eighty hours is over. So yeah, we'll start that. So now what I can do, I can just uh, turn it off, uh, hold press, uh, which will uh, uh, boot into the, um, what would I say, which will boot into the device normally. Also, I believe it won't, uh, it uh, won't delete your data. But however, if you are desired to unlock the bootloader, please make sure you take the backup of all your data. So yeah, we'll start, we'll see that several days later so guys it is almost uh, 10 plus days we have started it for 22nd now it is uh, 4th uh, october so uh, it so some little bit it got delayed so here i have my phone uh, which i have uh, uh, what i would say i already have uh, uh, removed all the uh, pin and security these apps and all i already have the backup so when you do this one take a backup before that so now i will connect to my usb cable and it should be good to go and i have to select no this one also it is already has the usb debugging turned on so that is good to know now in my pc i'll open this uh, ma tool again and it will ask for the administrative access so not flashed so i have to use the unlock tool uh, it is in uh, software android development and um, note 10 pro unlock bootloader here i have it so i'll open the unlock tool make sure you don't touch it uh, after uh, uh, touch to change the mi account or something if you try to change it uh, you have to wait again a week or something so yeah now uh, i'll just i don't want to update it i'll agree and i need to use same account which i have used previously so i will just sign in and we will get back to that a few minutes later okay now i have logged in so it should work um, so not not uh, no device is connected so i just disconnect or i need to do it in the reboot uh, to bootloader so i will just turn it off here so now i need to hold the volume down and the power uh, which i will hold now okay we are in fast boot uh, now i will connect to my computer here as you can see it is done unlock will erase that user data so i have already did it so warning please make sure you unlock this um, take the backup before unlocking the device unlock anyway and yeah so now we already have waited one week so it should the process should uh, go along and we can easily do the next step yeah so now the device is unlocked successfully so it is rebooting and here it is showing doing the uh, factory restore as you can see here uh, we have the unlocked symbol which indicates that the device is unlocked now
okay so now we have booted into the uh, miva 13 uh, i will just do the normal setup uh, not much into that uh, i will just uh, skip most of the part and here okay okay so finally we have uh, set up to uh, this one and unlock the device in next video you know what we are going to do we will uh, uh, install the twrp and then we will root the device and one by one we will uh, start doing the things so yeah that's what about uh, this video and thank you for watching code motor